when you have want to choose this kind of lifestyle it's good to have an income absolutely yeah and uh, we are we are going in this direction anyway uh, who, who more who who less because maybe with smoke is is uh, organized another way because uh, we, uh, we we have to give them instruction and uh, uh, feet and uh, yeah I'm, it's something yeah it's just something for for what we we have to think how to organize maybe I know <laughs> well, I have friends that are traveling around because we have in Italy this good luck that we have the right of homeschooling and thanks to covid and this is a very good thing of this um, virus 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 is that a lot of school happens online so when you are a teacher you can live everywhere now and there are teachers with their tiny house and their caravan they are traveling in greece they're traveling to the oceans with their kids and do homeschooling and earn the money by teaching on zoom the the kids in the whole world so yeah. and and kids love it to travel kids love it to be in nature and live with the parents in a big tiny house this is beautiful yeah for so, them it's like a play like a job maybe also yeah <laughs> new places you know today we live in a jungle today we live in a on the ocean this evening there and here this is a big adventure it, that's much better than sitting on a chair in a classroom much better to, to live for, to, to learn in, in a more free way you know through internet uh, yeah. from nature from the from traveling traveling is a teacher I think the, the schools in the future will close because the kids do not want to go back to school <laughs> No, I, I just imagine this situation, but uh, not maybe yet, but uh, yeah, it can happen. It can happen. Yeah, because we just experienced that now. But I think that, yeah, that will have to also be some more changes like uh, new uh, system to to learn. I mean, new new plans, new... Uh, it, 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 because this is traditional way, so they had to adapt it for online instruction. Well, there are some in Japan, Japone, in Japan. Mm -hmm. They have done some researches, experiments. When kids do not go to school, but can learn when and where and what they want, they do with 14 years the, the, the maturity, you know, the, the maturity. Normally you have it, you'd make it with 18, 19 years. But when the kids are free from who and where and when they learn, they, they um, are much faster, four years faster. Wow. Because and this is the story I told you that I am doing research about water. Sitting on a chair does not help to be intelligent. That's Sitting on a chair is but not is already true. happening. You know, in Italy we have this homeschooling, and some friends of mine they do work together, and they hire a teacher privately. The teacher is teaching the kids. At the end of the year, they do the exam in a school, and that's it. So when you know when these these kids have to study only two hours a day, because as I said, when the kid can. Um, study at home in a, in a healthy environment they study in two hours what you normally study in the school in five hours so the rest of the time they do things like music art gardening and only two hours things like mathematics and italian language and so on but yeah but um and it's legal in italy that's legal yeah, this is why so many German and Austrian and Northern people that do not do want to put to, to send their kids to school come to Italy because here Italy is great. But uh, but uh, I mean uh, not everybody can uh, afford to to pay private teachers. Well, you know, private teacher today is not so expensive anymore because a lot of young students, for example, they take 10, 12 euros 
when you have three kids together, you pay five, four euros a day. So it costs less than the bus. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> <laughs> not not always maybe but yeah more or less it would be <laughs> yes but anyway um, let's see how this will be devolved we humans we are so creative we can create everything some mothers they go every day with the kids in the in, in the wood they have a little cabin there so the kids can play together they are outside they breathe fresh air. As you know, breathing is good for the brain. When the brain has air, when you breathe the air, and then you move in nature, also when it's raining and also when it's cold, um, the kids are so intelligent that they, they learn in one hour what people in school learn in five hours because they are sitting there. You know, my son, I've seen what is happening here. The schools are so afraid. I love the teachers. The teachers are heroes at the moment. But there are parents that do, um, they are so afraid that the kids harm themselves when they're outside. There is a cloud up there and the kids do not go out because they could get a cold, you know? So the kids are always inside. Always inside. So all they have two meters, like in a, like in a fabric to move. Uh, I, what I wanted to say now is uh, my side, I trying to stay, let them stay outdoor how much they can, how possibly they can. I mean, they don't watch TV. They just want something on the uh, internet and not in Italian, in English, in Polish. Sometimes I listen, what do you listen in? Japanese, Chinese, Russian. That is <laughs> okay, <laughs> but uh, um, I mean uh, that's my from the beginning. I decided that, that TV uh, will be cut out because it's it's uh, to it's they they have so much power on us, especially on the kids. Yeah, that's not not uh, something what I want for my kids. I want that they will free to choose whatever they want, the life, whatever that they want, even the religion, philosophy, whatever. Um, As you said, when you <clears throat> let your kids choose, they are, they learn five languages languages just by fun. Just by fun. Because kids want to learn, they want to learn. You know, when you begin to do some researches on the schools, the schools, how they are still now, have been created so they have the rich people have workers. So the kids have learned from the first day, sit up, sit up, you know, like, like a dog. Yeah, you cannot talk when a teacher talks, you must do homework, you cannot go to the classroom. Yeah, do you know? I, I come out from me here, the Montessori. Montessori, it's opposite, <laughs> and I didn't find it here. <laughs> it's completely there are some schools, but they, they I, we have no, no, in Italy, there are some Montessori's. But the funny thing is, Montessori is Italian, but she's more famous in Germany, in the northern lands, in Italy, she's not so famous. But this is always like this that in the land where you are born. It's not so valuated, but Montessori, you can find it in Italy. I have here some very good schools. The, Ital the Italian school system is still better than, for example, in Austria or in Germany, because it's very inclusive. Because in Italy, I don't know if you know this, they have closed the psychiatric uh, institutions 20, 30 years ago. And so they are very inclusive here. This is very beautiful. So I don't like the school system, but compared to the northern, like Germany and Austria, Italy, Italy is still better I because it's know inclusive. That. Yeah, I didn't know that. I mean, because I'm Polish, but there are not so much anymore, so much, mm, so straight, I think so. In Germany and in, in, in Austria, it is. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's 